happy spring. What's up, you family? Today is the first day of spring. How about that? I don't know if I'm happy about it or not. It's sad to see the cool weather end since I'm a cold weather person. And then, you know, we're going to get the storms and all that stuff coming in, which we already have had. We've already had that, so I guess that don't matter. I want you to just excuse the way I look today. I'm still in my night shirt. It's hot already. It's 70 something degrees outside. I'm going to show y'all my, show y'all something that I've been growing. <laughs> Don't know what to do with it. Okay, let me turn you around here where you can see it. Since I can't make anything grow, look. <laughs> This is a, I got a dowel rod holding it up. Um, I bought some of those clamps at the Dollar Tree. And right now I've just got twisties on there and I'm afraid it's going to make my plant die. This one's already, I know the sun's probably glaring. Uh, this one right here is, is already looking kind of bad. As you can see, hopefully you can. I'm getting a bad glare. Yeah, it's dying. Oh my goodness, yeah. It's turning into ooky mush down there. There it went. Okay, well, we'll get that one off of there because, you know, you don't leave dead stuff on there. I'll, I'll, well, it's, it's unconnected to it now. And I'm getting a little, uh, that, but my mother always grew <laughs> a potato plant course like I said I've said before she can she could grow anything anything and I'm gonna turn my yeah Gary he's crazy he he calls them the stinky pots I meaning my wax warmer toys down here on the floor and yes halls to do it's a mess but that's out because yesterday we celebrated with the kids, uh, we celebrated Gary's birthday. So, now he's caught up with me. If you want to say he did. Uh, his six, six, 65th birthday, which is not officially till Monday, but still, we celebrated yesterday. The kids surprised us. They brought, um, they brought everything over for the barbecue. They had in mind for a barbecue. They usually want to take us out to eat or something like that, but uh, this time it was a barbecue, and my son cooked. Yay! You know you don't usually do that, but he's learned he's learned to barbecue, and so you know he's he's wanting to do it because he he learned to do something. He's just like a little kid. He's thirty three years old. He'll be thirty four in June, but he's still just like a little kid. Always always will be. He's gonna never grow up. So anyway, and we don't know, but tomorrow might have to take this little fella here. My hand's covering the lens. There we are. Focus. This little fella right here to the vet. He has got himself a cough going on. He's not doing it right now, thank goodness. I want him to get some rest. But he's coughing. He does. He has done this before. Actually, twice. Well, he's actually he's done it way more than that. But uh, I'll kind of say recently, um, he um, before that he had swallowed, you know, the little the little uh, plastic that's on, you know, your the, the the tag on something like your clothes or whatever your shoes, you know, the plastic part. Where the tag is, he, he had actually swallowed that. And I think we were on our way to the vet or something. Or right be no, we got him an appointment and all that stuff. So right before that, he finally hacked it up. He had, he, he had been hacking all night long. And we, we, you know, just doing whatever we could to help, help him be okay till the vet opened up. And sure enough, he hacked it up. And then he was fine. It was over. So we called the vet and told them, and they said, well, 
then you know it's up it was up to us if we wanted to bring him on in so we said well if he acts like you know that he needs to come we will bring him okay he's raising up now he might start in coughing again and he's he's a roly-poly yes he's a fatty <laughs> my baby don't know what i'd do without him but anyway then then the next time he done that um you know he wouldn't stop it was just he tried to like he was trying to cough up something we thought well he has swallowed something else well we don't really know if he really did or not but when we got him to the vet that time he said that he had uh, bronchitis bad case of it and so he got a shot he got medicine and stuff like that so we don't know if that's what's going on this time or not See, like right now, if he had something in his throat, he'd just be keep on hacking. Unless he got it up. Because when he got up that plastic thing, I, I was in here. You know, I was in here in the dining room. And I heard him hack and hack. And then I heard him sound like he had hacked up something. Well... I didn't make, pay it any attention at first. And then I got to thinking, you know what? He's not even coughing anymore. You know, it dawned on me that he had stopped doing that. So I got to looking around. It took us forever to find it. And when we finally did, hey, mom, well, want to say hi to everybody? Want to say hi to everybody? When I finally did find it, there it was with all slobbery stuff and a plastic ring thing. Yeah, which he licks everything. <laughs> I hit the wrong button. Dang it. Now I'm going to have to put, I'm going to have to spice these two videos together because I'm not going to record again. I do that. I mean, well, edit. You know, these two together. But anyway, I want to get him on here and tell you the story of Romeo. He's quiet right now. Maybe he hacked up whatever it was. I hope so. So I want to wish everyone, you know, this is not a haul or anything like that. I just wanted a quick video to wish everybody a, a happy new uh, first day of spring. And I hope everyone's well. I'm still really tired from yesterday. <laughs> not used to it. and um, But it's a good tired. I'm so happy. Um, to get to see the kids. Hadn't got to see them since Christmas. You would think they live a long way away when they live like five blocks away from us as well. Yeah. Busy. They got a busy life. So that's the way it goes. So anyway, um, we went to Walmart last night, by the way, after we got through with the barbecue. Me and, excuse me, please. I went with them. We went to Game Exchange. He was telling me about all the DVDs they had. And I looked around and I thought, oh boy, this is overwhelming. And I don't even remember what DVDs I have and what I don't have. So I didn't get any. I said, well, I'm going to look for that one movie. And um, if I don't have it, then I know where, where it's at. I had several. So, and the prices are good on those. It's the animated movies. It's the prices are, you know, they're 10 bucks. So. Might as well buy it new for that. You can find you can find a lot of those, you know, for five, seven, ten dollars, you know. So I don't I'm not gonna do that. Uh oh I can't do that. I hate close ups anyway, but okay, my hand's slightly in the way, but my arm's getting tired. Phew. So anyway, um we did that and then Amy, she's my that's my oldest granddaughter. She's like, yeah, let's go to Walmart. <laughs> I said, hey, I'm with y'all. Wherever y'all want to go, let's go. So that's what we did. We went to Walmart. My son was sweet. He went and got me a cart, you know, because I can't walk far. He went and got me one, and then I was complaining about, I'm so thirsty, you know. So he goes back there in the back of the store <laughs> where the water is. and gets me a, he gets me this, in fact. He gets me this. I don't like it. Ugh. This life water. 
immune support. Zinc helps support immune function. Purified water with zinc. Electrolytes for taste. Taste is pretty bad. But he he thought that, you know, if he got me one out of the, the you know, there in the store, you know, the little freezer things, refrigerator deals, he figured it would be a lot of money. So <laughs> he said, I'm going to go pay 2 or $3, Mom. So he gets that, and I, I drink that much. That's, that's how much I drink. That was, yeah. Really, it's got a bad taste. I mean, I'll eventually drink it because, I, you know, I don't want to waste anything. <laughs> I don't know. Don't, you know what? You don't waste nothing. So I will eventually drink it. But um, I looked up there in the front, and the, one, of, one of the waters that I like is uh, Aquafina. You know, I get those when I can't get anything else. Aquafina, Nestle, and Ozark, Ozarka. Ozark is my favorite. Yeah, I hate it when I can't get my hands on that because that's that's my favorite water. It's smooth, no aftertaste. It's just I love it. Gary hates it. He has to get Walmart brand. Of course, we can't agree on anything. That's what being married for forty-seven years will do. <laughs> I guess I don't know. So anyway, we did that, and I bought some wax. I'll keep my mouth shut because I'll add that in with one of my hauls. I didn't get anything really just that. I got, but you, I will let you know what kind I got. Wax from the wax warmers. Yeah, I did get that. And I got a cake. That's what I want. That's it. Watching my money nowadays. Yep, yep, yep. So anyway, y'all. I love each and every one of you. Thank you so much for watching. And happy, happy, happy spring. Thumbs up. And I'll see you in my next video. Mm, God bless. I love y'all.